everyone, welcome to day five of your 30 day booty challenge. This is our first session today that we're gonna be using equipment. So we are using a TheraBand today. If you don't have one of these, don't worry, you can still do every exercise without it. Otherwise, if you've got one around the house, go grab it here now. We're just gonna use it to get that extra burn through the glutes. So let's start guys. We're gonna bring that TheraBand up onto our legs, just above our knees. All my little kittens coming in here, pickle. Alrighty, so it's just above the knees here, guys, and our first exercise, a little bit of maneuvering. We're just gonna be down in a four point kneel, hands under shoulders, knees under hips. We're just gonna be going for our fire hydrant, so lifting that leg out and then closing back in. Out, closing back in. Exercise two will just be that on the other side. And then we come down on our side for our clam. So we want our legs stacked, heels on top of each other, knees on top of each other. And with these ones, I want you to lock your heels together and just lifting up to that top knee. Now your main cue is to keep this hip press forward. Don't wanna be rolling back here, just a small lift. We'll switch over to the other side for those clams. And then we're going to finish off with hip bridges. So down on our bum, legs start together. We're gonna to press up, open the knees wide, close back in and back down. Lift, open, close and back down. Are we ready to do it? Are we ready to go? Pop that TheraBand on the thighs just above the knees. Now my one looks like it's not gonna do me any favors today. It's rolling all over the place. If that's the same as you, just maneuver it whenever you need to. We're on in three, two, one. Hands and knees. We just open out to the right and close back in. So this is a challenge for that tummy here as well. We wanna try and keep those hips nice and balanced rather than rolling all the way to the left side here. And just a reminder guys, we are doing 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, just like our previous sessions. So we wanna avoid rolling all the way to that left side here. That's where we keep this right hip just slightly pressed forward and we really feel the burn in the outside of that right leg. Just for three, two, one, and relax. The fire is already there quick little jig of your TheraBand. And just getting ready for those fire hydrants on the left side. Three, two, one. Let's do it, left leg lifts up and lowers. So again, for this one guys, trying to keep those hips level so the abs are really switched on, belly is drawn in. You want to feel a squeeze through the outer booty on this left side. So you want to feel it round through that hip, that outer thigh. Just for the last 10 seconds, staying lifted through this chest. Shoulders back and down away from your ears. Three, two, one, and relax. There it is. All right, down on your side. So I want you lifted onto your forearm here. So you're lifted through the waist, bending through the knees, heels are stacked, knees are stacked. Now you're gonna lock those heels together and lift through the knee in two, one. Just a lift up through the knee, pressing those heels together and close. Now, same cues with this one, like I said, during that warm up. We're gonna keep this top hip pressing forward. So you don't wanna see any rolling back. It may mean you get less range with your lift, but it's perfectly fine. You're gonna feel that deeper burn through that top glute here. It's like that cramping sensation, which isn't pleasant, but it's where the juicy stuff happens. Okay, last three, two, one, and relax. Alrighty, I want you to roll straight onto your right side. I'm just gonna flip over so I'm facing you. Exact same thing on the left side. So working through the left glute here, just down on that right forearm, making sure you're lifted through that bottom waist, legs are stacked. Two, one, keep those heels locked together, just open that knee and close. Pressing this hip forward, feeling that deep burn through that top glute. 
Now I really wanna make sure you are pressing strong and lifted through this right arm and think about actively lifting that bottom waist away from the mat. We don't wanna see any sinking down like this, holding up strong. A lot to think about. And at least try and hold it up at the top for one count before you close. We don't wanna be throwing those legs all over the place. Three, two, one, and relax. Great, roll onto your back. Even exercise to finish this off. So you'll notice guys, I'd like to finish that fifth exercise with something that's using both legs, just so one side doesn't feel sore than the other when you're finished with your session. Start with your legs together, one and two, one. Let's lift up into your bridge, squeeze your glutes, open those knees, close back together, and then slowly lower the bum. Press up, squeeze, hold, open, close, lower back down. So really squeeze and hold your bridge as you open those legs, pulling that theraband apart, close it back together, then lower back down. Lift, open, close, lower. Feeling again, that outer booty really start to fire up here. Coming into the last five, four, three, two, and one, lower down. Whoo, round one done. So let's get ready straight away to do those exercises again. So we're back on our hands and knees and we're starting with that right leg. All right, three, two, one. We're in that four point kneel, right leg lifts up and lowers. So I want you to try not to bring this right knee down to the mat. It's just a sweep up and then just hovering it off the mat. Just so you can really focus on that core stability here as well. Keeping that left knee down. And your abs working hard to keep these hips as level as we can. Again, just trying to bring in that one second hold at the top. Just four, three, two, one. Bring it down. Whew. Oh, yeah. Readjust, readjust. Okay, so same thing. Fire hydrants on that left side. So just making sure that position's correct. Knees under hips, hands under shoulders. Three, two, one. Let's do it. Left leg comes out. Control it down. So, just like we've said throughout the whole class, trying to keep those hips level. You may notice you're trying to roll over to that right side, but you may get less range when you're doing it the right way. So, don't be fearful of not being able to lift your leg as high. It just means you're isolating into the right muscles. That crampy sensation that we're aiming for. Last five. Three, two, one, and rest. Whew. Okay, coming straight onto our side. Oh, I've got a very slippery, slidey therabend today. All right, we're on in five seconds. Heels and knees stacked. Three, two, one, lock those heels together. We're just lifting up through that knee and lower down. Keeping that top hip press forward. No rolling back here. And just remembering to stay nice and strong through this left shoulder. This bottom hip is pressing and is actively lifting up away from your mat. Final 10, big lift. Feel that deep squeeze into that top glute. Just for three, two, one, and rest. Ooh, okay, rolling straight onto your right side. I'm just gonna flip it round here. Rejig that band. Oof, all right, legs stacked. Right forearm down, pressing and lifted. Lock those heels. Three, two, one, let's do it. Open and close, really. Locking these heels, pressing nice and strong through this band.
having that top hip, top hand on that hip, just as a guide here. Try not to move overall back this top side. Get in the shakes. Let's go for three, two, one, and relax. Ooh, great stuff. Rolling straight onto your back. Final exercise. Down on your back, legs together, ankles and knees squeezing together to start with. One in three, two, one, let's do it. Squeezing up into your bridge, hold, open those knees wide, squeeze them back together and then lower back down. Lift, open, close, lower. Close and lower. Really thrusting those hips high. Keeping the hips high as we open those knees and close. Under 10 to go, keep this gut. You got this guys. Just for three, two, and one. Lower down. Woo! Bring it up guys, you can take that TheraBand off and that is your 10 minutes done and dusted. Thank you so much for tuning in for day five and we'll see you tomorrow for day six. Woo! Bye guys.